Please welcome Ethan Wakeser. Statistical anomalies. According to Dr. Ali Benazir, the statistical probability of us being born sitting right here, right now, is 1 in 10 to the 2,885,000 power. That's essentially zero. <laughs> Starting with our parents meeting, 1 in 20,000 multiplied by them staying together long enough to have kids, one in 2,000. <laughs> Visually, consider this. It's a life preserver thrown somewhere in an ocean, and there is exactly one sea turtle swimming underwater. The probability of us existing today is the same as if that one sea turtle popped his head out of the water and right into the middle of that one life preserver on the very first try. <laughs> so, as we move through our lives to college, the military, careers, families, keep in mind, when times get tough and you feel like the world is against you, maybe that challenge you're facing is actually for you, an opportunity for you to learn something and that your challenge makes you, indeed, a lottery winner. Be grateful for your statistically improbable life. As it turns out, there was yet another lottery I won, as did all of you graduating today, this entire class of 2018. Did you know the chances of being selected to be a Raleigh Charter High School student are between 9 and 13%? Those are Ivy League numbers, and Brandon, remember, I got in first. <laughs> of course, our lottery numbers are random, Ivy League colleges are selective. I kept that statistic in mind throughout the last four years, even when times got tough, because each and every day, I saw my Raleigh Charter teachers, administrators, and peers working very hard, my statistical standards kept rising. Not just academically, but as a citizen of the world. Walk the halls of Raleigh Charter, and you will observe and engage in conversations about life, the world we live in, volunteering for good causes, different religions and cultures, career dreams. It was here that I gained the confidence to say out loud, I can be a neurosurgeon like my grandfather, a dream I never thought myself capable of even contemplating. I thank my statistically improbable Raleigh Charter lottery win for teaching all of us to dream big. Finally, as we graduate, move to different states, meet new people, fail miserably, stand back up, fall in love, get our hearts broken. Let's keep our passions in mind what is fun and fulfilling, and what makes us feel inspired, energized, and grateful. And when you're feeling a little off track, remember, a jet airplane flying from Cleveland to Oakland only stays on course about 25% of the time. The other 75%, the pilot is constantly making course corrections to get to the goal of landing safely in Oakland. So, course correct, take chances, be adventurous, be of service, take the road less than less traveled. Focus on your one and precious life. And call your mom and dad. Yes, we do ignore your texts 98% of the time. <laughs> Even though 42% of us can actually text with our eyes closed. <laughs> 
100% of us actually still name you, our parents, as having the most impact on our lives. Thank you to all our parents, grandparents, and guardians here today. So, class of 2018, we have already won. We have already succeeded. We have already beaten the odds. Let us continue to win. Let us continue to beat any odds we face. Let us continue to be statistical anomalies. The world is waiting for us. I love you guys. Thank you.